Hey, Steve Zook, welcome back to Pope Sue Channel and the Guitar Ladder System. Hey, this, this, I, I've played these in stores a million times and they've never sounded that good to me, but man, this one sounds incredible. It reminds me a lot of a, uh, an old Martin pre-war 30s 0017 I used to have. I actually had two of them and I, they sold for big money. But this is the, I think it's an AC240 Ibanez. It's got a solid top. I've got tens on it. Listen to this tone. And it don't don't send me a message and say, oh, it sounds good because it's in Dad Gad. It's it's great sounding guitar. I mean, you can say that if you want, but I'll ignore it. But you know, it's not true. This um, every guitar, like I've said a million times, every guitar is a little bit different. Some of them really speak and really sing, and some don't. I can't prove it, but I I really think this one might have been you know uh, made with some older wood that was aged more naturally and stuff. It just sounds. And like I said, it's got tens on it. just beautiful it's got that old kind of martin you know 0017 you know 30s pre-war martin tone and, and it has barely been played too so it will, it will sound better using a zoom q3 it's like a, it's like a hundred dollar you know a zoom video recorder with really small cheap mics so if you can hear that tone man it's just i love i love the sound of solid mahogany top Mahogany is a really overlooked wood. People don't realize how warm and mid-rangey and mid-bassy and defined and clear and transparent and open and natural woody reverb mahogany is. It's just an incredible wood for guitars. <laughs>
guitar for the money, trust me. But that's what I do. And I and the, the, the open pour thing, you know, they don't finish it with a bunch of lacquer and stuff, which chokes mm -hmm. the guitar. This guitar, one of the one of the reasons, besides the fact that Ibanez knows what they're doing, is you know, not, it's not it's not being choked by a bunch of you know lacquer finish or anything. It's kind of an open wood, you know, they call it open pour or something like that. But yeah, this this is really a man. This is really a nice sounding box. Always hard to let this stuff go. Hear that mid-range sparkle and that mid-bass definition. That's it, man. Most acoustics are kind of shit howdy, you know. Get the bass and the mid-bass. The bass and the mid-bass are the weak areas. This guitar just, I don't see how this how a guitar like this could sound any better. I really don't. It's a solid top, laminate back and sides, but it's a high quality laminate. And actually laminate wood, a lot of people don't understand this. High quality laminate wood has a certain transparency, a certain openness, a certain reverb, a certain mid-range magic. And when you pair that with a solid top, it's a beautiful combination. That's what tends to. But you know, buying and selling guitars is a passion to me. I really don't make hardly any money at all. I usually lose money every year, but I just love doing it. I love having the stuff around. But mm -hmm. I, I've been in music stores buying strings tons of times, tried these in different stores, and none of them ever spoke to me. But uh, I, I got a guy got in touch with me that wanted to sell a couple guitars, and, and I tried this one. I was just like, whoa, you know, I think I see a little, see a little scratch right here. And, uh, you know, you, you might find some surface level scratches or something. I don't really see too many of them, you know. It looks really, really good. But, uh, yeah, this is, this, is, this is a lot of guitar for the money. It sounds just beautiful. All right, Steve, 714-548-0385. Don't let the message about the student loan, uh, save on studentloans.net, confuse you. I have another company. We save people money on student loans, but you got the right phone number. Um, 714-548-0385 or email me steve67 at yahoo.com that's s-t-e-v-e-z-o-o-k the number seven not spelled out at yahoo.com all right take care no case or bag on this one i'll just double box it